Hello and welcome to Sam's Tropical Garden coming to you from South Louisiana. So today I am talking about fruit. I just cut some fruit today for the butterflies. This is actually my butterfly garden. I really like my butterfly garden. It's looking so beautiful. And today I'm just giving you guys some tips on how to get butterflies, the male butterflies, and maybe some females here and there that want that are pregnant and need nutrients. So butterflies don't feed up just on flowers. They feed on other things too. Like they feed on fruit, they feed on bananas, they feed on kiwi, they feed on any type of rotten fruit you have, they'll feed on. So yeah, that's what I really got. And um, this is actually a really good idea for butterflies. So this is just a little fruit example. I got kiwi, I got bananas, rot smushed up bananas. And of course I got an apple. As you can tell, it's an apple, though. And so, I've been waiting. It's officially March now. And look, a bumblebee! Yay! And then, oh, don't land on me, bumblebee. I need to pollinate my flowers, but don't come to me. I don't want to get stinged. So this is my parsley. It's kind of looking yellow right now. I don't know why she's looking yellow. Oh, yeah, because it's not getting enough water. Sorry. So I need to water that, and I need to water other plants. So this is just a quick tip on how to get some beautiful butterflies. Like the red admirals, giant swallowtails, eastern tigers, pelamini, spice bush, common trucker skipper, um, hummingbird clearing, and um, some other ones of course, but I don't remember on top of my head. Well hummingbird clearing is a diurnal. It's a moth that flies during the day. You'll get some of those, but they are kind of rare to find here. They are mostly found in the northern states. So that's, this is how they attract some beautiful butterflies. So, and there's red admirals, common chicken scoopers, and other, and, um, and just some other things you'll get. And the red admirals, of course. You'll get a bunch of red admirals and some other things. And then of course I got some nectar sources like um, salvia, mom, but that's not really a good nectar source. And some vine, and then some Mexican sunflower. So that's pretty much it for now, and well, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Bye.